Hi, welcome back to Cheryl's Art Desk. And so today we're gonna do something just a little different than a letter or a number. And I came up with a beach scene. And I know it's February, the end of February, but I thought, let's remember there is nice warm sun coming and it'll be a great time to go to the beach if we can. So I have our picture that I sent home and I sent home uh, some clouds and the sun to go with it, okay? And I sent home a bag of seashells. This is the beach art that I was talking about, okay? So it's really simple. It's a sensory project for our little ones. So, but all we need is glue. This one I made super easy and simple. And I thought it would be fun for the kids to try to touch seashells. Okay, all right, so here we go. We got our seashells. Everybody should get, I think, five, okay? And then we'll take out our bag of sun and our clouds. Here we go. So, here we go. We're gonna put our sun over here and our Seashells, we're gonna glue onto our sand beach area. All right, so here we go. Get a big cloud, smaller cloud, and then another smaller cloud. So I think everybody got three clouds. Okay, are you ready to do it? Okay, here we go. So take, go ahead and take your glue and let's do our beach scene. Are you ready? Yeah, okay. So what's really cool about this, let me do this first, is show the kids the different types of shells. If you can get them to touch it, let them feel it. Yeah, ooh, that's smooth and then rough. This one has ridges, you see that? Ridges and then it's smooth on the inside. And these have a type of bump, they're bumpy. Do you feel the bump? Yeah, okay. So I'm gonna put a little glue where I want the kids to put their seashells. You ready? Okay. Because they're heavier, you're gonna probably use a lot more glue, so like a bigger, Okay. Oh, well, let's do one at a time. So let's take a shell, put on. Oh, one shell. Here's another shell, put on. You put on two shells. Okay, let's go, put on more. This one's bigger, so I'm gonna put a lot of glue for my big one. So let them put it on however they decide. If they wanna go upside down or up, have the hole up, that's fine. I'm gonna put mine like that. Okay. And then here's another one with the ridges. It's, you see this? What color is this shell? What color? Does anybody know? You know. White, yes. I'm gonna put that on. We have one more shell to go. And we're gonna put that one right here. Yeah. There. I have one, two, three, four, five shells. You see that? There's my beach scene next to my umbrella. Now I'm gonna put on my clouds and my sun. I'm gonna put my sun on first. Sun, you ready? Put a dot right there. I'm gonna put my face right there. Okay, there we go. Now I'm gonna put on my clouds. Now you could put glue on the picture or right on the cloud. Whatever works for you is cool. All right, here we go. One, one cloud. And here's number two cloud. Two. Yeah, 
Now I'm gonna put on one more cloud. Here we go. There. There's my clouds. Now, if you want to, you can leave the sun as is, as uh, the way it is, or you can take something uh, like a crayon, a marker. What color is the sun? What color is the sun? Anybody know? What? Yellow, that's right. So I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna make some rays. And if you want to hand over hand and have your kids help you with that, there we go. I should have mentioned the the yellow one or the yellow color earlier, but that's okay. Here we go. And you're gonna to have to let it lay flat to dry. Okay. And there is our beach scene. There it is. Our shells, our umbrella. You have sand. The ocean is blue. You have white clouds, yeah, and your yellow sun. All right, there we go. That is our beach scene. I hope the kids enjoy this. I know I did. Until next time, we'll see you soon at Cheryl's Art Desk. Bye.